Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today is a very special doll box opening today. So I'm going to tell you a little tiny little story. Uh, basically, I was looking on the internet for dolls and I came upon something very interesting. I found another Make It Mine doll. I also ended up getting a few more other items as well. And basically, I ended up finding this Make It Mine doll for $12 and $11 to ship, which is priority shipping. So, I ended up purchasing her, and she is the second sculpt to the Make It Mine doll. So, today is her box opening. So, what do you say? We get this box open, and we get started. So, the first thing I see in this box is this which is a note from the seller which I have bought from this seller before I actually bought an outfit and apparently she has a lot of these dolls I, I don't know where she's getting them from because originally she only had two listed and apparently the two sold now she has three more listed and these three are it's the same price so this one it, it basically is a thank you letter it says thank you for your purchase I have included her broken foot oh and by the way this doll when she when i basically ordered her it was basically a doll that had like my other one when she came to me had a busted foot so i was thinking that she wasn't gonna have the foot with her but she ended up putting the foot into the package along with her and she even saw and she even saw her with her sleeping bag maybe you can find a way to make it work these little girls are weak in the ankles so if you Remove the other foot. Make sure that the ball joints are lined up and perfect. Enjoy. And her name is Annie. And um, basically, she's pretty much the same as my other making mine doll with the busted foot. And I really don't mind because the truth be known, what you can do, you can take hot glue gun, squirt it down in there, squirt it on the foot and stick it in there. Or you can just take uh, duct tape and tape it around it. I really don't care. So basically, I ended up getting the other scope, which is the Taylor scope. So let's get this girl unpacked, and we're going to see what she looks like. Because I have never really seen her up close. So this is what she's starting. Yeah, this thing is just ridiculous. <laughs> wow, she is well packaged. The, the, she actually started her in an um, Office Depot box. Really, you, you wasted that box. Oh, wow. Okay. So, um... Yay, here she is. And she's on her little sleeping bag, so I'm glad for that. Because I was kind of wondering if she was just going to send the, just the doll. And she actually sent her with her sleeping bag. Which, the tailor sculpt comes with the little green sleeping bag. And just like her, my, the other one's purple sleeping bag. This one is the smiling sculpt. Oh, look at her. And she did send her foot. Oh, thank you, God. Oh, and she even sent a little underwear. Oh, there goes the foot. <laughs> and the little shoes. Oh, wow. She really is. Uh, yeah, I'm going to have to uh, get some the, some um, hot glue and fix that bag. But, oh, wow. She is so cute. I, I've always wanted the smiling scope one. Mm, rubber band. So, what do you guys say we unbox her? She's very beautiful. She's a beautiful doll. And she is right. They do have very weak ankles. Because their ankles can come apart. And so unfortunately these dolls don't. Um, how do you say. Um, last very long. Go to it. Oh wow. Her hair is coming off. But that's okay. I can fix that problem. So basically just take the thing off and pop the hair out and like I said it's the smiley scope <laughs> and she is so adorable see you this is what she looks like and she's a 16 inch doll and I like that they have her leg wrapped up as well and don't worry about the other leg it's on the floor I'll pick it up in a minute so yeah these dolls are pretty cute when it comes down to it I love the little bob cuts the only issue that you have with the wig is they really don't stay because of the little slick 
kids, but they are nice dolls, and they are a, oh, they are a BJD doll that are designed for children. They're, they're BJD dolls that are definitely designed for children. So, in this case, when it comes to these dolls, <laughs> you can, uh, you can, um, You can, um, how do you say, um, change out their eyes because their plate comes off. And this is actually, her face is actually a sculpted face. And you can do, you can redo her sculpt and makeup and everything and change what she looks like. Although this girl is, she is cute. She is just, I love the way she looks like she's been blushed. And I think she has been. I think her blush is a little more, um, more blushy than normal. So it looked like somebody had did a little bit of work on her. But yeah, these are beautiful dolls. And they're cute little dolls for your kid or your 13 or or something like that. So yeah, and she has a basic point of articulation. She has articulation in the neck, although her head doesn't go up and down very often. Uh, she can turn side to side. She has articulation here in the waist. Oh, sorry, don't worry about that. See, she has articulation in her waist. She also has articulation here, as well in the leg and the knee, as well as her ankle. This is one of the reasons why ankle. Unfortunately, her ankle can pop out, so that's one of the reasons why she basically breaks. And if you're going to do her head skull, it does come off, just squeeze and slide. And this is what she looks like inside. And this is the eye mechanism here. You undo this and basically you just move it out of the way and you can pop the eyes out. Or you can also put putty in their eyes, but it's up to you how you want to switch their eyes out. Right now, I'm not really worried about switching out the eyes because I really don't feel like buying heat eyes for a doll. But she is a cute doll. Uh, her head is giving me problems. And there is a way to make her, um, her, her wig cap stay on. You basically... Um, attached her, attach her, her wig. Uh oh, watch it. I'm gonna break her. That's not on. There we go. So basically, they're saying that you can, you take a rubber band and you can place it on her head and that'll keep her wig on. But yeah, she's a very cute doll. And I love the way she looks. She's very adorable. And I cannot wait to redress her. Because I will be redressing. Even though I love the little hospital. The little night scrubs. It's just that they look a little bit too much like night scrubs to me. And they are cute. But I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to actually make the... I'm actually going to give her a new shirt. And I might let her keep her capris. These little cute little capri pants and I'm not worried about the leg because I'm just going to take duct tape and put it on and she can have her own way but yeah she's an adorable doll guys and like I said if you want one of her um you can go on eBay you can go on um um on their website which is called make it mine is the make it mine website and you can look up these girls and their normal price <laughs> is $49 for one of these girls and they have four two different scopes which is this is a smaller one and which is, the other one is the um the pouty scope that's what they call them and basically when you get there you will learn that there are four of them there's this one which is Taylor this is Taylor the other one is Haley which is the one with the black bob and then you have the two uh, dark skinned girls. I know one of them is named Jordan, and I forgot what the other one name is. But they are very beautiful dolls, and they are perfect for kids who want to get into the BJD hobby, who wants to be just the ones that are just starting out for this. So, guys, if you really want your daughters and daughters and stuff to learn about the BJD skills and, and stuff, just Get her one of these dolls and let her play around and see how it is to change out the wigs and to ma maintain the eyes and do the little um, face-ups and stuff. And I promise you, you will have a nice doll for your daughter or, or son or whoever to play with. 
these dolls, they're beautiful. So guys, don't think they're not. They're 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 so much fun. And they're a nice doll, and they basically, and oh, you can buy fantasy parts for these dolls, as I said in my other video. You can buy one bar part of the body, you can buy centaur, um, which is, it. it I, I haven't seen the centaur one yet. It may be a little bit expensive, but I think the centaur one is like $30, as well as a mermaid part for her, because her lower body here, which is here, You can pop it loose, and you this that is where you put the the mermaid tail or the centaur body onto her body. She is a lovely girl, and these are lovely dolls. And guys, just because they have a broken foot, don't let them basically deter you from purchasing them. Because this lady, she does sell them at a good price. At twelve dollars, you're paying almost. Uh, it's like a 20, it's like a, almost a 90% drop in the price. Because she's, these dolls normally go for $49, $50, including shipping. And I, I'm not sure how much the website charge for shipping. But you basically end up paying about $20 for her. And I ended up paying about 20 bucks for her. And she's worth the price that I paid for. Uh, basically, I'm not complaining because the other one came to me the exact same way. And at first, I was kind of unsure if I wanted to keep her or not. But then I was like, screw it, I can fix her foot. So I do, unfortunately, I am going to have to purchase this girl some clothes. Or for now, I'm just going to produce her an uh, outfit. And uh, basically, I'm thinking about uh, switching the colors when it comes to it. But until then, this is like the only pair of shoes I have. And unfortunately, this one is coming undone. And it's going to have to be fixed. So, luckily, hot glue does it in five seconds. So, I'm not going to freak about it. And the wig, as for the wig, I will figure out a way to make the wig stick. And I do have more wigs here. So, I am going to try to make this girl into something good. And I'm thinking about actually filming her makeup video. As well as I am going to bring you guys some makeup videos for some much larger dolls, which is my 17 inches princess, Arab princess, Disney princess dolls. So I do have two that I am planning on making over. So guys, I really am going to do all this stuff. So until then, guys, I'm going to have to say peace out. I want to get a shout out to my family and I want to get a shout out to, uh, Emily, as well as Malia, as well as her, their mom, which she's about to get married. So, guys, get ready for that because I'm thinking about actually filming the wedding. So, we'll see what happens. Until then, guys, I'm going to have to say peace out because my video is getting too long. And, guys, thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. All my subscribers, thank you so much. You guys are so cool. And I'm, I'm I, I can't thank you enough. And guys, don't be afraid to comment with me. I don't mind. I will cut if if I if it's a, if it's a contact and you want to ask me a question over to to con com comments, I'll answer your questions as fast as I can when it comes through. So until then, guys, I'm gonna say peace out.